Jelly Roll acknowledged that he had practically all of his status. What in the did I think? I suppose he will simply have to accept it. In a new video for GQ Wednesday, Jelly Roll talked candidly about his pretty large tattoo collection, saying he regrets getting 98% of the designs. The 39-year-old singer of Need a Favor, whose real name is Jason Dwight Live Day Fort, has hundreds of tattoos all over his body, including his face, however, at nearly 40. He expressed sorrow for the choice he made when he was a teenager. He began the video by saying, I regret 98% of these tattoos, 97%, almost all of them, and revealing that his core philosophics had evolved. And now that I am 40, I wonder what the I was thinking. Zelly Roll acknowledged that he did not know where to start when it comes to beginning a tour of his status. The country artist who previously disclosed that he had tons of tattoos while incarcerated said, I don't know. I had to aim all before beginning with a picture of a baby smoking a blunt. The Grammy Contender admitted that a lot of his tattoos were covered up work after calling the design a little excessive. Jelly Roll claimed the ones that were really bad have already been covered up. An example of a cover up was an inked drawing of the Nashville skyline over a design that said, Surviving the struggle or at least that is what it was meant to say. He revolted about the poor little tattoo, saying we had forgotten to put the it in it. So it said surviving the struggle. Subsequently, the CMA winner displayed a cross with the words Reef Moma, revealing that it was his first tattoo obtained at the age of 14 following the death of a family friend to AIDS. Regarding his multiple first tattoos, Jalino said that he could not really remember getting his first one because there has been so many now, but he claimed that the huge cross on his right sack was his most magnificent tattoo, adding that it was symbolic of a sense in me.